Welcome, everyone, to the ultimate game in the college football season. Everything has built to this, the battle for the national championship and college football immortality, a moment that every young football player grows up dreaming about. And it almost feels like we were destined to get to this point. The top two seeds of the college football playoff have survived. They've been on a collision course all season long. They've come through the challenges and the distractions, and now they'll fight for that beautiful trophy. As we'll see the number two seed in this playoff, the Pittsburgh Panthers taking on a team from the Big Ten, the Michigan Wolverines. For EA Sports College Football, I'm Chris Fowler, joined here, as always, by Kirk Herbstreit. Kirk, everything has been building to this. It's time for the national championship. Let's crack. Play action here on first down. Quarterback leaves the pocket on the move now. He's got an open man downfield, and it's caught. Tackled at the 44, but good enough for a first down. And the runner takes off to his right. Runner finding some space there. That's a solid gain on the ground. Offense getting set. It's second down. going to run it here. Makes a nice move there. He's wrapped up nicely there by the freshman. An important third down attempt for this offense. He'll try to move the chains here on the ground. The first down pickup tackled at the 45. Boy, an opportunity missed here by this defense. They get him to third down and hold up the line of scrimmage. But they could not deny this back and coming up with that conversion. They pick up four, so second down and six coming up. And here's the handoff. And they'll stop him after a short game. With the defense coordinator this week all the way telling us about gap integrity, not giving this running back any creases at all. Really sound defense on that play. Back to throw. It's Barber. On the move, looking deep. The catch is made for a huge pickup. They bring him down, but a big chunk of yardage on the play. In all of our prep work coming into this national championship, I really wondered how this secondary would hold up against this quarterback and this group of receivers. They better be ready to make some adjustments because right now, this quarterback is having his way with them. And they finally stopped him, but a decent game that time. So here comes second down now. Every play important down here in the red zone. And off in a single back formation. And tackled after a small pickup there. Here we go. Third down close to the goal line. They can still get a first down without scoring. Got to pick up the third and short through the air. And he'll make it in for the score. Touchdown, Michigan. Who says you need explosive plays, Kirk? That was a long, winding scoring drive. And think about this. This is a national championship. And you're able to execute like that against this quality of a defense. And that is a great job by the coordinator and the quarterback being in sync and putting together a heck of a drive. From the shotgun now, here's a handoff inside. To bring him down right at the 30-yard line. I think this defense keeps thinking about them throwing the football, and by doing that, they're opening up running lanes. Good positive yards there by the running back. Breaks loose at the 45. They bring him down, but an explosive play by this offense. Big game. Big runs like this are just demoralizing for a defense. It's one thing to give up big plays over your head against the pass game. When teams can run the ball and pick up yards like this, really affects the team's mental psyche and their confidence. And you'll start to see some missed tackles following a play like this. So, second down after the incompletion. We'll hand it off. Tackled after a three-yard gain, so a 
which sets up a third and seven. We come to the line, a long way to go for the first down, but needing this crucial conversion right now. And he'll drop back here on third down. He's going to take off. Get some space around the 30. He's got enough for the first down and still going. And he'll make it into the end zone. Touchdown, Wolverines. Well, the defense is so caught up in stopping this passing game that they underestimate what this quarterback can do when he pulls it down and can take off. He takes this one all the way to the house. Got it. Breaking free at the 35. Tackle made after a big game. They trust the left side of that offensive line and come up with a huge play on the ground. Yeah, your favorite, Chris, there. The old pin and pull there to the left side. Great blocking on the left side, able to create a great push. Nice crease in the back. Found that with the vision and picks up some big yards for that first down. Fires it on the move. It's caught downfield. Tackle made, but it's a huge gain all the way to the 33-yard line. Another chunk play. This offense is really clicking. It's a shotgun run call. Defense gets him down, but they'll take the game on that play. Chris, it's pretty surreal to get to the national championship in this day and age of college football. When everybody wants to spread you out and throw the football. This offense has been pounding the rock all year long. Got space, looking to score. And he muscled out of bounds very close to the goal line. Man, this quarterback can play the game. He can throw, and as we see here, he can run the football. The defense does everything that they need to with the pressure. They look like they're in good position to be able to come up with a nice play. Fights his way in for the score. Touchdown, Michigan. He just goes up and over the pile for that touchdown. And that's some serious vertical by this running back. A well-earned touchdown on the goal line. And they'll keep it on the ground. Running back has the handoff. Moves the ball to the 25, good enough for a first down. Of course they're going to pick up the first down by running the football. You think about Michigan, you think so many legacy, incredible backs that they've had over the years. Tim Biakabatuka and Tyrell Wheatley and Leroy Hoare. Man, it's so... Oh, and nothing but green grass ahead. Rips off a big game. Finally tackled at the 46. That's a nice completion here by this Michigan offense. And when Michigan is really clicking, you think about over the years... They've been efficient within that passing game, being able to throw the football to complement a very physical running game. On the junior, gets home making a sack there. Chris, this one's on the quarterback, in my opinion. He's got to have a better feel and a presence in the pocket to be able to either check it down or get rid of the ball. You just can't take the sack. He'll throw it now. And it's incomplete. The defensive pressure affected his throw that time. Challenging spot for the offense. It's third down and long from the 45. He's escaping the pocket now. He's found some room at the 45. And he stopped it, but not before. An explosive play moves the ball all the way to the 32. Well, here's a quarterback that just takes control for himself. Picking up some nice yards when nothing else is there. This guy's a real threat. And the Wolverines come to the line to set a fresh set of downs. Rolling to his left outside the pocket. On the run, he'll let it go. He's got it for a big game. He'll be taken down, but he does have first down yardage. Offense set for the sixth play in this drive. Using the ground game here, tailback has the handoff. Makes it across the goal line. Touchdown, Wolverines. And that's another touchdown for this guy. This defense better adjust and get eyes into that backfield. He may go for a third or a fourth later today.
Off the play fake, looking to throw. Extending the play now. Breaks loose at the 40. The stop is finally made, but it's a big game. Stopped at the 49. Man, it is fun to watch this guy get out in the open field. I didn't realize he could run like this. That's a big game for this offense. Here's a first and 10 play. Scanning the field, it's Parber. Quarterback escapes the pocket. Easy throw to a wide open receiver downfield. Touchdown, Michigan. Still no answer for this offense. This guy can do it all. We've seen him go behind coverage and make plays downfield. We can see him catch the ball underneath, just like this. And when he catches a football, he is so dangerous after the catch. This one leads him into the end zone for the six points. Single back takes the handoff. Brought down, but it's past the line of the game. Boy, another nice game by this back. He has had a beautiful day today running the football, just kind of in that zone, and a big reason why they have a nice lead today. A change of direction. Chris, it's the consistency of this back is giving this defense fits. They've got to come up with some changes up front. This guy's already over 50 yards, and if he keeps running the way he is, not only is he having a great day, but it's going to give this quarterback a chance to hit some big plays downfield off play action. Breaks loose at the 40. Out of bounds after another huge chunk on the ground. What a job by this offensive line today. There's nothing more that helps an offense than committing to that running game and popping an explosive run like this on the ground. Keeps the confidence of your offensive lineup. Same with your back. It helps everything else that you're doing as an offense in your rhythm. Now you can come back with some counters, try to take some shots off the play action, and keep hammering away with that run game. Second down play coming up. There's the snap, and he's looking to throw. Scrambling, now he'll make the throw. And it's intercepted. And he steps out, but that's the takeaway this defense was looking for. Boy, Chris, he hesitated just enough to give the defense a chance to get in position and come up with a big turnover. Takes the handoff, heads to the right. Now juke to man, but not much room to maneuver. Stopped after a small game. Another positive game by this back. I'll tell you, between the offensive line sustaining blocks and this back's vision and ability to explain. He'll take a deep shot. They try a downfield shot. That's a good effort there. Oh, and now it's third down. Looking to throw, it's Barber. Trying to extend the play. Looks like he's gonna run it. Breaking free at the 35. Oh, and he's in the clear now. It's a foot race. And they finally make the stop, but that's a huge gain in the scramble. He found some space and just went for it. Boy, this guy can do it all. We know what he can do with his arm, but when things aren't there, does a good job of pulling it down, knowing where the first down marker is, picking up the first down. The Wolverines have first and ten here. Get set, get set. Offense will keep it on the ground here. Ball carrier brought down at the four. Offensive great scoring position here. So down here in the red zone, every yard tough to find. Here is a crucial play coming up. Now this defense is going to have to mix up some looks because this back has had a monster day in the national championship. Running inside, running outside. The defense, and it's caught. Touchdown, Wolverines. 
great play design by the offensive coordinator. He's such a tough matchup down here. The tight end has size. He has instincts. He gets his head turned around, goes up, and catches the ball. Great play call and great execution. the play fake on first down on the run here taking a deep shot and that deep shot is caught for a big game tackle made quickly but a big chunk play for this offense through the air what a pitch and catch by the quarterback and receiver for a big game for this offense Offense keeps moving. It's a completion for a first down. There's the handoff. In the clear at the 25. They bring him down, but a big chunky yardage on the play. Well, the big fellow's Kirk flowing to the right there. The defense just has no answer. It's a huge gain. Yeah, and what a patience there by the running back. Just allowing those blocks to be set up there off to the right. And then once he saw the crease in the defense, accelerates through that hole to show you what kind of speed he has for a big gain in the first down. Back at the end zone, but out of bounds and incomplete. Coming to the line on second down, this is important. They want to avoid a third and long. Looking to scramble to his left. Touchdown, Michigan. To stretch the lead, the route is on. And it's just a thing of beauty to watch this offense. That's this guy's third touchdown. But give the offensive line a lot of credit. They're getting enough of a push to give him some room to show you what he can do with that space. Inside give now from the shotgun. And he's tackled right at the 40-yard line. I know this defense worked very hard at halftime to come up with answers on how to try to slow down this running back after the big first half. And he's already at it again. On the run, he's going to chuck it deep. Catch made all the way down inside the 35. The defense is spread all over the field, creating some one-on-one -on -one matchups, and the quarterback makes them pay for it. Big chunk play. This offense operating at peak efficiency. Looking to throw it on first down. Scrambling around now, looking downfield. He pulls it in for a big game. They bring him down at the seven. The offense set up now with a first and goal. The Wolverines will line up now. It's first and goal. Keep it on the ground on first and goal. Touchdown, Wolverines. And this one is getting ugly. That's another touchdown, a dream performance from this running back on the biggest possible stage. I mean, Chris, we're talking about the national championship. This defense has had a lot of time to prepare. They've heard all about him. In fact, they told us the only chance we have to win this game is we've got to stop their ability to run the ball and stop their running back. Off the play fake, looking to throw on first down. Quarterback moving out of the pocket, trying to create. He lets it go on the move, looking deep. That ball is incomplete. An aggressive deep shot on first down. Second down after that previous play. And he's back to throw again after that incompletion on first down. He lets it go on the move. Looks downfield and finds a receiver who worked his way wide open. Brought down to the 18, and suddenly this offense is in the red zone. Back up. 
So, Kirk, Michigan has the lead here at the end of the quarter. So three quarters complete in this battle and crown a national championship. Before moving on, let's check out the game summary so far. And that completion, Kirk, puts him over 300 yards passing today. Yeah, anytime a quarterback has a day like this, really, it all has to come together with the offensive line play, the receivers running these great routes, and he's just in sync. He's kind of in that zone right now, and he'll be the first one to tell you how much his teammates have helped him out today. Now it's second down here. To the air, it's Barber. Looking to scramble. And he heads out of bounds after a nice pickup on the run. That's what I love about this guy. Just getting good, positive yards here and continue to just keep this drive alive. Tight end goes in motion before the snap. In the third and short, they'll try to throw for it. He's moving out of the pocket. And that one is incomplete in the end zone. Interesting call here, Chris, to throw the ball on third and short. Unable to come up with a first down. Now here at fourth down, you got a big decision to make. Do you kick the field goal just to add to the lead or maybe go for this here with a chance to drop the hammer? Well, he did not make the first down yard. That's a big stop. For this. On first down, it's play action. Quarterback escapes the pocket and takes off. A quick juke. They get him down, but that's a good run. Enough to move the sticks and keep this drive going. And the Wolverines are going to cash in here in the red zone. These are the kind of plays that keep defensive coordinators up at night. You spend so much time putting your plan together to stop the pass, and then nobody accounts for the quarterback. He's got a lane. Can he make the end zone? Touchdown, Michigan. And the route is on. Wait, Chris, one, two, three. This is his fourth rushing touchdown in this game alone. This guy has a chance to not only be player of the game, maybe player of the week in the whole sport. The shotgun running play call. He's in the clear. Breaks into the clear. It's a sprint. Touchdown, Wolverines. And the beatdown continues. What a long run for the touchdown. I don't know if this defense was caught sleeping or walking in mud. I can't pick which one. Maybe it's both because the running back just went right by them so easily for the big game and a big-time score. Play action here on first down. Trying to create outside the pocket now. What's the play call here on second down for this offense? Use the running game to chew on this clock now. Jukes to get free. Boy, second forever. And this defense is, of course, expecting a pass, but give the play call a lot of credit here. Running the football, catching the defense off guard, a nice run, but really, I, I think it's more about breaking the tendency. Occasionally going with a play that the defense isn't expecting, and this one worked out very well for them. Touchdown, Michigan. Stretching the lead. This one is getting ugly. This is just quarterback wizardry. An amazing game with a national championship on the line tonight. This might be as good of a quarterback performance as I've seen in a national championship in some time. The defense has got to try to do something to get him out of sync by trading the blitz or sit back and change up coverage because what they've called up to this point just isn't working. Keeping it on the ground here. And they stop him after a six-yard gain. So second and four. Takes the handoff again. 
tackle is made, but that's good for a first down of the 47. What a shock, right? I mean, this guy once again gets his hands on the football, and great things seems to happen. He's over 120 yards on the day, and it's really been a combination of his vision and speed along with really dominant offensive line play. Tackle is finally made, but not before a big game. They'll spot it at the 24. How about setting the edge there on the right side of that offensive line? I wouldn't be surprised if they keep going back to the well, pounding it behind that right guard and right tackle and tight end, seeing what additional damage. Got a lane. Can he get in? Touchdown, Wolverines. To stretch the lead, the route is on. That's another touchdown for these guys. Man, they have had a day that you dream about. Whether it's the quarterback, the running back, the receivers, the offensive line, the entire unit has been dominant. What an emphatic statement to close out this national championship run. You know, the coach told his guys, go out there and leave no doubt. You say mission accomplished. Well, sometimes a team wins a national championship and they just got hot at the right time. I and mean, there's other times when it's been clearly the best team in college football all year. To me, these guys have been right up there as the top team in college football. And it's very fitting that they not only win it, but they win it in grand fashion. Well, that's going to do it for us and wrap up another outstanding season of college football. For Kirk Curb Street, I'm Chris Fowler. This has been a presentation of EA Sports College Football. They are officially your kings of college football and national champions, the Michigan Wolverines. Thank <laughs> you.